year, during the Spring Festival, the Chinese New Year, a massive migration involving hundreds of millions. Just to reunite with your family members for the New Year's Eve dinner. New Year's Eve dinner is the highlight of the Spring Festival, the most important festival in China. Similar to the Thanksgiving dinner and Christmas dinner in the West, the Chinese New Year's Eve dinner is the year's most ceremonious meal for 1.3 billion people. The origin of the New Year's Eve dinner is said to date back to the mythical age when a monster called Nian came out to rampage once a year. When it appeared, each family gathered its members to pray to their ancestors for protection. They also set off firecrackers soon afterwards to scare off the monster before sitting down to dinner with all doors and windows shut. This tradition was called Guo Nian in Chinese, and the ritual later evolved into the Chinese New Year celebration. With changing times, people have stopped being superstitious about the monster Nian, but the tradition of holding the New Year's Eve dinner has been passed from one generation to another. New Year's Eve dinner is like a review of the year's harvest, and therefore the top principle is being luxurious and rich. Given China's vast territory, diets and cuisines are different from region to region. Although all should carry lucky implications, as people have good wishes for the coming year. Dumplings are a main component at the dinner table on New Year's Eve in North China. Dumplings resemble silver ingots. And the making of dumplings represents wrapping up treasures. Eating them means having an affluent life. Some families put coins in dumplings, and those who happen to chew on them are said to have better wealth in the coming year. By contrast, in South China, the habit is to eat a glutinous rice cake because it is homophonic to a rising year in Chinese, signifying better harvests and a better life in the new year. Other dishes that carry good real homophones in Chinese are as follows: fish, which signifies having supplements; glutinous rice balls, which embody happy reunion; desserts, which forecast a sweet life in the future; hot pots, which implies a booming year. In the past, when many Chinese people still struggled to make a living, people anticipated the New Year's Eve dinner. Because it was the most luxurious meal of the year, blessed by China's booming economic and social development, the New Year's Eve dinner has become about more than eating nice food. Instead, it now focuses on the family bond. These days, many people no longer cook the New Year's Eve dinner at home. Instead, they eat out at restaurants, place online orders, and have the dishes delivered to door. Some even send for a professional chef to prepare the dinner at home. Although the New Year's Eve dinner has changed in its format, its essence has stayed the same. It still embodies the wish for family reunion. Year after year, the homebound people continue their annual migration across the country to be home for the New Year's Eve dinner. The family bond is the most treasured feeling for Chinese people. Therefore, the New Year's Eve dinner is more than a meal, but an embodiment of family reunion and the memory of a unique taste.